Welcome to the VMware Cloud on AWS video series. In this video, we will discuss host subscriptions. When you deploy a VMware Cloud on AWS SDDC, by default, hosts get deployed at an hourly on-demand rate. When you are ready to purchase host subscriptions, verify that you have enough funds associated to your account. To check funds, click the menu icon in the top right of the console and select Billing. Then click the Manage Payment Methods tab and verify that a default payment method exists. If you are eligible for any promotional credits, you will see them in the Promotional Credits page. In this case, we have a credit of $6,109. The promotional credits won't be applied to the account until they have been activated. Click the Activate button to begin the process of enabling the credits for this organization. Clicking the Activate button on the pop-up message will apply the promotional credits to the organization that you currently have selected. Note that promotional credits are assigned to email IDs and can be redeemed against any of the organizations where the user is an organization admin. Now that we have verified that a default payment method is configured and we have activated our promotional credits, we click the Services tab and select VMware Cloud on AWS. In this organization, we already have an SDDC. Selecting the SDDC, you can see that it already has four ESXi hosts deployed. These are all hourly on-demand hosts. We can add subscriptions for these hosts by clicking the Subscriptions tab in the primary menu bar and then clicking Create Subscription. Here, we can choose the number of hosts to be added to each subscription as well as the region of the hosts. Click Next. Select the term of the subscription. You will see the discount based off the hourly on-demand rate for each subscription term. Click Next. Review your order summary and click Place Order. You may close the current page. Your subscription, with its corresponding status, will appear on the subscriptions page. It takes approximately 15 minutes for a subscription to become active. We will click the Create Subscription button again and add three more host subscriptions to the U.S. West Oregon region. This time, we will choose the three-year subscription and follow the same process to place the order. As you can see, your account can have multiple active subscriptions of different lengths and regions. However, once you have created a subscription for hosts in a specific region, those host subscriptions cannot be moved to another region. Rather, new subscriptions for the new region would be required. Once the subscriptions have been activated, you will be notified in the VMware Cloud on AWS console. Updating the subscriptions page, we can see that both our one-year subscription and our three three-year subscriptions have been activated successfully. The four current hosts in this SDDC will now be covered by these subscriptions. Any additional hosts added to this SDDC will be added as on-demand hosts until a subscription is added for them. This concludes our VMware Cloud on AWS subscription demonstration. Thank you.